It was awesome. I think it was uh, a long time coming. This was a big moment for me and my family. I think the game went well. I, I had some I had some butterflies leading up to the game for the first time in a while. So that was that was all exciting. And then the crowd was great. The field was perfect. The, the stadium's amazing. Overall, it was a plus tonight. This was a huge game for us, and I knew it going in. And I mean, a couple of the senior players knew, but obviously we didn't want to overemphasize it, especially for some of the management, our league, Jesse, ourselves, just to keep the fans with us. It was important to win the game. Yeah, yeah, no, we 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 spoke right after the game, and Jesse gave a nod to to Kimar and Matt Miazga for stepping in and doing an amazing job. I think both of them held their own tonight. Matt showed his calmness, and, and Kamar showed his, his willingness to work, and I think the two of them did great. Damian Perinell again had a really good game, two games in a row, so I'm very happy with the back line tonight. Anytime you get a shutout, I think we're all happy. No, I thought it wasn't just Matt, but Kamar as well. Those guys played very well. They worked very hard during the offseason and during the preseason, understanding our system so that they that when their number gets called, they'd be ready. And I felt like they did that exact they did exactly that today. It was very good. You know, um, I felt I was partly to blame on the counter attack when they got the penalty. So for me personally, I was happy that you know we could keep that clean sheet for Lewis because he didn't deserve to have a goal scored against him today. The clean sheet is definitely the cherry on top. I think the most important thing is that we got three points. It was good for us to get that monkey off the back early so that we can continue to build our confidence, knowing that we are a good team, we've got a great group of guys, and that we have big goals this season that we want to achieve. Yeah, it was, um, it's the kind of thing I badger on to these guys in a week about, you know, when I spin or if I make eye contact. And I, I remember Dax getting the ball in some space in the middle of the field, and we kind of looked at each other, and I just knew to spin. He obviously put it on a um, plate for me, and I just tried to get some room and hit the target. Yeah, that's a bit of our game plan, winning it up high. and. My goal, the second goal, uh, is exactly how we've been working on it. I think Felipe might have won it up high. It went to Brad, and then he wants us just running and making runs and being options, and Brad found me and we scored. It definitely feels good, but I think more importantly, we just want to continue to build off of each performance. Even last year when we weren't getting results, the reason we were able to succeed in the end is because we built off of it. And so it is a temptation right now just because we're doing well and getting results that maybe we're a good team. But, but yeah, we're a good team, but we have the possibility to be a great team. And that's what we want to achieve.